Wink. Minion in, it is Atlas time. I can't wait to try this. I've got a three hour trial. A three Atlas, hour a trial. Massive pirate. You'll find a guide to Atlas's movement controls on the right. Try Press white square. I don't think I have white square. This is beta. There's going to be a lot wrong with it. Um, the description even says, you know, the game is buggy. Oh my god, that's terrifying. Oh, you know, I hate underwater stuff so much. It's made. It was very difficult for me to play Sea of Thieves because of the, the deep sea diving and the. So, so this isn't going to be this isn't, isn't going to be easy for me either. You know what? Screw the tutorial. The Usually I'm, I I I hate being the guy who doesn't play the tutorial. But uh, out of the water. God, there's so much. I'm not going to read all that. It's not an interactive tutorial, which um, kind of sucks. Here's what got my attention about this game. I have loved Sea of Thieves and have become recently very disillusioned with Sea of Thieves. I'm going to go ahead and make a character. It seems like there's a lot of character customization options, but they really, none of them really matter at all. And it's just a trial, so we're not going to spend a lot of time on character creation already. Here we go. I your life. Oh, is that, are you going to talk? One of us has got to talk. Is it going to be you or me? Which is more than I can. Oh my god, that's so buggy. This is all just, I mean, and that's, somebody's building another ship over there? Okay, I haven't played now, much Ark, but this just, this seems like it might, it's Become just a Ark. We're not going like to look, me. we're just going to swim. Over to the other player, this is a PvE server, so we're okay. And that is, God, that's far down. Oh, that's terrifying. Duh. Don't look, just don't. What's with that music? It might be a ah! being attacked by a manta ray. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> Whew! There was nowhere to go. I spawned like this is ridiculous. See, there's look, there's some land. There's like, you know. I spawned on the side of a mountain looking at the ocean. See, here's there's the opposite. I can what the f farts? It's not dangerous, that's good. Okay, there's somebody building another ship. It's gonna be massive. Okay, so the first order of business in games like this... Get a little lag. Thanks to whoever built this. Wood staircase. Owner, Keith Hayes. Very nice. Well, thank you, Keith because I would have been stuck down there otherwise. I appreciate it. Pick stuff up with Y, punch stuff with RT. So, this is how we gather wood. Reeds, okay. That's one thing about Ark that always, the punching of the trees. It's not just Ark though that does it, there's a lot of survival games. I'm not a fan of the outfit. The weird later hose and overall thingy. Okay, my health is going down quite a bit. I guess punching, well, I mean, punching trees hurts, so that makes sense. Can I pick any of this up? Can't pick any of those plants. Island is already filling up with crap other people have built. Let's see a few huts. There was a single player option, which is nice, but what would be the point? Of, oh, look at that. Ooh, we should find some place to cool down. But I could jump back in the water, have my ass eaten off by manta rays. It's a bee? Are you kidding me? I'm fist fighting a bee. Come on. Come on. Screw you. Now there's more of them. Run! I'm almost dead. I'm gonna get killed by freaking these because I've lowered my health punching a tree. I'm not impressed so far, honestly. I don't know how to build. 
Maybe I should have read the tutorial. Now I'm that guy who was like, I can do this without the tutorial. But seriously, that tutorial was a lot of text. And I didn't want to spend my three hour trial reading that stuff. The area around an island should be shallows. It shouldn't be the island ends <laughs> deep ass ocean. You gotta let me ease into that stuff, man. There we go. Okay, I can give I can forgive lighting problems because it's a shop. There's NPCs. Why didn't we? Is that what we saw in the distance when I was killed by bees on the other server? Cosmetic skins, clothing, dyes, magical ship figure. Okay, and ship stuff too. All right, we're gonna have to do what we did with the other one. We're gonna have to punch some trees. Okay, on the other, with the other guy, I just had to hold down the button, and uh, he punched automatically. But now I have to push once per punch. I don't know why that is, but it was definitely more convenient the other way. I mean, that's cool. That's that's really that's neat atmospherics right there. I wonder if that has any purpose. Are there quests and missions to do? I really... I really don't know. Okay. Let's try to figure some of this out. Crafting. Can I craft anything at all? Do I know how to make anything? Do I have to find recipes? What's the... What's the deal here? The Bufter family compass. Handed down through many generations. Ah, it has nine power stone slots. Okay. My compass can carry power stones. Whatever that is. Okay. So. The basics. Basic element for survival. It gives, this, gives skills. Okay, so basically I have to punch trees until I have enough skill points to buy the first set of crafting skills. It's interesting. Or I could just go get killed by bees again. This is already monotonous. At this rate, this three hour in this three hour trial, I'm not gonna get around to uh, I'm not gonna get around to building ships. I mean, I can see my XP going up from punching the trees, so I guess I just, I'm just gonna keep punching. But at this rate, I'll be lucky to be able to build a ship and explore the actual pirating part of this game before the, the before my trial period runs out. I understand that you're hurt, dude, but you gotta punch more trees. Level up is available. Thank you. Access inventory to apply it. No? Access skills? Requires one skill point, which I do not have. So maybe it is inventory. Bump buffer. Yeah, oh, my health is going up. That's nice to see. <coughs> Food is going down. Not good to see, but makes sense. Okay, so how do I apply the level? Whenever you earn a new points. level, you can improve one of your character's fundamental attributes ah. by selecting one of the stats on your inventory screen. Health and weight are good ones to start with. Health is your hit points. Pure... Okay. Inventory... Jesus, that thing has four tusks. Okay, so... We're gonna go with health. Woohoo! Bump Buffter level two has leveled up. So now I can buy the basics. Which means improved water swimming, I see down there. As opposed to improved land swimming. Yeah, I know you're hungry, but you know what? You don't have the skills to eat. So now I can craft stuff, right? I can I can do 
a note, a bed, a shirt, campfire, flint, stone, yeah, how am I going to get that without a pick? So now I need to make, that also requires, the pick requires stone, fantastic. The hatchet requires all of this, I have none of that. In Atlas, you're often surrounded by ocean, but you can't drink seawater. Finding potable water requires some effort. On land, you can dig for water by going prone on low ground, then dig using the controls really? to the right. You won't get much water this way. I have to way. dig down with my bare hands to look for water. You can also drink directly from freshwater sources on islands, like ponds and rivers. Okay, well... Let's start digging. Can't dig for water here, seek greener grounds. Alright. What the farts is that thing? Come on, dig. Oh my god, I'm terrible at this. Woohoo! Did I find water? Yay! Yeah, drink it. Did I drink? Am I good? Water is depleted in this area. <laughs> it's way too survival-y and not piratey enough. From looking at the trailers, I thought that this game was maybe made by people who had played Sea of Thieves and felt the same way that I do about it and had made the game that they wished Sea of Thieves were. Clearly, that is not the case. Clearly this is... I'm, I'm starting to worry that this was just a cheap cash grab to cash in on the, um, the disgruntlement that so many Sea of Thieves players have. I'm slowly gaining experience. But I, f I feel like if I just start punching some of these animals, they're going to kill me. And it's going to be very embarrassing. This guy, maybe. I killed a chicken! Level 2. Drag body? Really? Is Why would I need to do that? Why would I want to drag the body? Can I just harvest the body? Can I loot it? I feel feel kind of taken advantage of because it's like the developers knew that there were so many of us ridiculously unhappy with uh, being completely ignored by Sea of Thieves and uh, promising us something better and then not delivering and I can't craft anything without stone so can I can I punch a rock no. Well then how am I supposed to get stone? If I can't punch a rock like I did with the with the trees. Hmm. It's a mystery. Maybe I can just pick it up. Can I pick up that stone right there? Okay, uh toggle third person. Much better, I think. So there's no picking up the rock. Even though I need rocks to um, to get ahead, to do stuff in the game that I need done. Yeah, it's... There we go! We can punch rocks and get stones. That's so stupid. Since this is basically a copy of Ark, there's potentially dinosaur-sized giant things swimming around in the water out there, which I am not thrilled about. I mean, the, the whale in the trailer looked absolutely massive, and that's actually pretty cool. So I guess the next step is to make a fire, for which I will need stones again. And now that I have a stone pick... Ta-ta-da-da! I can I can get those easier, right? Yes! Oh, so much better. I mean, don't get me wrong. I dig survival games. Okay? I love them. But, uh... 
I wanted to play a pirate game. Oh, I feel like this thing is going to rip me a new one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Suck it, Wilbur! Oh my god, this is... And now there's two of them? They're helping each other! Screw you guys! Not cool! No kidding, I'm injured. You were killed by a level 2 pig. No, I was killed by two pigs. Okay, the one pig I would have gotten. But that's... So did I lose my inventory? A level up is available. I lost my inventory. All those trees punched for nothing. I was just trying to get some hide, man. I don't remember where I was. Was I down here? I think I was this way. This, do I have a... Oh, get that, that, there's the, the pillar that says you died here. Which is good because the map is... Oh my god. Just the controls, man. I'm going to lose so much stuff on the way there. We're going to... There! Elderberries! That's what my father smells of. Or so I'm told. Wild female chicken level 7. That cow was level 4, and I just got killed by a level 2 pig, so... So what can I craft now? Have I learned new stuff? Because it doesn't seem like I have, even though I bought a skill. Come on. There we go. Construction and mercantilism. Mercantilism? Who the hell knows? No fleet of warships, no great bastions set against the Roaring Sea could have been crafted without learning first to hone the tools that the environment supplies. It is the foundation of all that great empires. Yeah, okay. So, what's, for, what's down further here? Advanced swimming? Really? Water temperature fortitude? Ugh. It seems... Okay. When you have to skill swimming, you know there's going to be a lot of swimming. I love that that lights up at night. That's actually pretty cool. What a, oh, I hear a pig. What level are you? Level 8! No, thank you. Message in a bottle. Okay, let's check that out. That's not even... Is it floating in the air, or... Is it standing on top of the water? I'm, I'm confused. It's a treasure map. I wonder if the treasure's on this island. Oh. I can't kill the cat with a little too fast. Water. Thanks. What are you? Monkey. Oh my god, I feel terrible. I don't feel good about this at all. I feel bad. But it's better than getting killed by pigs, I guess. And it's so cute. I don't want to... Oh, man. That just looks like I'm carrying roadkill around. How do I harvest it? How do I get hide? Oh my god! Are you kidding? I have to hack away at the dead body with a hatchet? This is terrible. That poor monkey, man. I feel awful. What else have we got? And what is glowing over here? What's go what's, what is this? What's going on? <coughs> Flotsam. Getting anything out of this? Okay, 
maybe you need a different tool to harvest flotsam. It's confusing. I don't want to kill... Okay, how much hide do I have? Because I don't want to kill a cat. I really don't. I have four hide. That's enough to make some shoes and some gloves. That one's level 19, but they don't fight back, so... I feel so bad. Oh, no! Oh, this is awful! Oh, no, I don't want to do this. Oh! I killed a monkey. Thank you for killing. Oh. No, 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 don't open your inventory. I guess. Pick up the roadkill. Put it down on the beach and then. Whack it with your axe. Oh, come on! Oh, that's. that's so bad. Chicken. Seagull, whatever. Of course it's gonna fly away. Oh, it's going to attack. It's fighting me. Okay. The monkey didn't fight back, but the seagull is going to kick my ass now. Oh my god, would you just... I can't even... I need to go back in the third person. Now. Bro, come on! How am I supposed to defeat, defend myself against Jonathan Livingston over here? I'm tired. Stop moving for a moment. I'm being attacked by a seagull. Don't tell me to stop moving. You know what? Why don't we just I'm too injured? Oh, I'm gonna get killed by a seagull. Okay? That's how badass a pirate I am. And I'm tired, so what am I gonna fall asleep and let it pick me to death as I take a nap? Oh my god. See, at least I'm close to town, so. A heat wave has begun on top of everything else. Heat wave is the least of my worries. The seagull is going to kill me. I'm gonna have to stick to killing cute little monkeys. Level up how? What have I done to deserve a level up except kill two defenseless monkeys? Construction, the basics of building. Thank you. I didn't know there was more tabs. Walls, roofs, ladders. Apparently nothing for ships yet, though. Does that come later? Beast mastery. And then combat, melee weapons, archery, throwing weapons, firearms, armory, medicine, artillery, Seamanship. Captaineering. Those who have spent time to study the way that the ship speaks and its conversation with the oceans have earned this title. Okay, basics of sailing. That lets me build ships. Well, when does that get unlocked? Because that seems like... I have 20 skill points available, really, and I've only... But I don't want to spend them in swimming. Okay. Well, hand-to-hand -hand combat would be useful. The 
because I am getting, I mean, I get beat up by everything. Archery and throwing weapons? No? <sighs> beast mastery. Be one with the beast and their ways open up to you. Oh, I just unlocked hand-to-hand -hand combat. So now it's... Okay. So maybe somewhere on this skill tree is... Seamanship! There it is. Okay, okay, okay. We have to work towards that. So, weaving. Yes. Secrets of building. And seamanship. So now I can build... Now I can build ships? Okay. See, this is... That's better. Yay! I'm getting somewhere. Look how my skin glistens in the rain. I am shiny. Alright, what do we got? Cosmetics vendor. I'm not interested in cosmetics. Thank you very much. I like how the ocean is more more wavy in the storm. Crew recruiter. Ah. Okay, you can recruit an NPC crew for your ship. I can buy a respec there. And that is the, apparently, extent to what I can do in town. Okay, so now I have built this stuff. Three walls. Okay. LT for place. No, LT was dropped. Come on. Try this again. Uh, RT for place. There we go. That's really it's tiny. I'm gonna need more than one of these. Unless I want to have a tiny house that I can really can't place. Can I put? Can I place this? Can't place that floor. Feet must be on the ground. Okay, because that wasn't place, that was jump. Woohoo, I made a floor. Apparently I need to make like three more of those. I bet I don't have enough thatch. Where's the floors? There's a ceiling. Door. Floor. I need like 60 thatch. 62 thatch, okay. Let's go punch some more trees. I'm sorry, what is wetness? I got, okay, I got rained on, so my wetness is at 70%. I have a wetness, you guys. So now I can, now I can place them, right? Not on top of the other one, doofus. Okay. God, I'm gonna need so much thatch. Can I build wooden walls? Come on, this pig, okay, this pig is really starting to piss me off. You know what, though? Can make a spear. Uh huh. That's right. Get out of my house! Get out of my house! And 
in my car. Come on. So, suck it, pig. I don't want to tame it. I want it to die. Decomposes in 25 minutes. So do I need to... Oh, really? Use the hatchet. Use the hatchet. Fur, bone, animal meat. How about hide? Because I really, I really wanted some hide. Yay, armor! It's a piratey looking shirt, so that's good. I'll give it that. I cannot. Well, I don't know how to build doors. So. Three more roofs, three more ceilings, another wall, and I, and I guess we'll just leave that open because I don't understand how doors work. I mean, that looks... Oh, that's how you zoom. Can I turn the... turn the map? Because that would be very helpful. It seems like you should be able to align... You know what I mean? But that is not not to be, I guess. <sighs> okay. I actually have to do this in my head. I can't do it on the screen in front of me. I can't just take that piece of paper and turn it so that they're both face. I mean, clearly north is that way. over here somewhere. Wait a minute. It's this crap. It's the flotsam. This is the treasure. Yeah. This is the X on the map. So. Do I just lay down on top of it and dig? <laughs> what do I do with it? In order to sail a ship, you have to obtain one first. There are two ways to do so in Agnes. If you're in a free port, you can buy certain ships from the shipyardsman at the end of the dock. There's that guy. How much does this how much does this one cost? Fibers, wood, and hide. God, so many fibers. Okay, this is basically a rowboat. It's a dinghy. A raft. Ramshackle sloop. Okay, so I guess we're building. We're buying a ship. For that, we're going to need wood and thatch and fiber. So I guess I'm just going to walk around and do this for a while. Ugh! 
couple more. Buy that. Name your sh name your sleep. Squeeze. Okay. So now I have a sloop. Which there's a ladder in the back of it. Can I climb up there? Is that possible? Hold for options. Like emergency ladder. How do I get in my own ship? Hold still. Long enough to Oh my god, climb up. Climb up. Climb up. Climb up. Oh, there's my ship, guys. It's completely inaccessible, but there it is. I guess my only option is to build another ship, build a raft next to it, and then jump into the ship? Raft. Oops, I didn't name the raft. Does that mean it's... Pick up raft? What? Oh my god. Is the raft in my inventory? It is. It is. This is... Item options. Can I put it in the water? Is that a possibility? What if I'm in the water? What if I put it in my quick bar? I can't. Go a little farther. That's a fucking shark! We're gonna go make another raft. Didn't name it again. And I don't want to pick up the raft. Lower anchor? Okay. There, there's the. Did you see the shark fin? Hold for more options. Okay, okay, um, um, fully close all sails. Jesus. I was just trying to get closer to my ship. Um, I don't want to fully open all sails. They're 10%. Are the sales up in 10% or am I just... Just got my thumb in my butt here. Okay, there we go. 10%. That is way more than 10%. Look how fast I am! Ah, oh, shh, Nike! Dude, this is not cool. Hello? Can I... Oh my god, no. No, no, no. Fully close all sails. Sheesh. Your sails are the main component that determines your ship's speed. Aligning or trimming your sails to the wind properly will make your ship fast and nimble. 
Rotate the sails using the controls to the right so they line up with the wind indicator. Green indicates your sails are catching full wind, and red means they aren't catching the wind at all. You can raise or lower the sails part way to speed up or slow down. With A? And L, up down. I'm confused. Okay, I didn't. Okay, apparently I can only do full or. Shit! We're gonna hit the rock. Oh my god. Okay, can I just. Well, we're not gonna hit the rock, we're just gonna go right through it. getting somewhere. Woohoo! I'm on my ship! It, it, it was just, it was ridiculous and way too hard. And now I'm on my ship. What I should have done, can I climb out of here please? Can I just, please, please, get out of this part of the ship? Let me just, oh my god. Well, now I'm stuck on my ship because I can't get out of here. Ship inventory. I was hoping to maybe access the sails from here through the, you know, the manning the sails thing. There we go. Whew. Man station speed ship sail small. Okay, so I have to... Well, the anchor's down, so... Can I just... How do I, how do I just pick half-mast? Is that not possible? Ooh, like that. I thought the anchor was down. Raise the sails, let's figure this out. Because I'm pretty sure I had the anchor dropped. Repair small wood plank? What? Are we damaged? Okay. I have to do some repairs. For whatever reason. Okay, so, I can man the sails, and then use the steering wheel. I get it. Okay, so I have to individually turn the sails into the wind. Okay, so, let's check. Hey, look, it's a dolphin. Better be a freaking dolphin. Let's check the map. Where can we grow? How the hell should we know? The map only shows one island. Okay, so. Since I don't see anything anywhere off in the distance, we're just going to sail around the island. We're going to test, test sailing around the island. No, 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 I want the sail down. That was a shark. Big one. I don't even care if we've got... That's a turtle. I don't even care about wind in the sail. I just... There, 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 there. Did you see it? Big ass fin in the water.
turtles groaning make are making me very uncomfortable. There it is. Look at that thing! Jesus, that's as big as the ship! Are you kidding me? No freaking way! Okay. Now, my bathophobia is not going to allow me to play this. If it attacks the ship, I'm, I'm turning this off. Are you freaking kidding me? Put that down a little bit. Pick up some speed. We're just sailing around the island. Oh my god. Whoa, 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 whoa! No, 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 no! Where are you going? Okay, a little hard to steer. Okay, let's see about turning the sail into the wind a little bit. The so wind's coming from the front left. So, okay, now we should pick up some speed. Oh yeah, definitely going faster now. Okay, we've got wind in the sails now. This is where a crew would come in handy. Just sailing around the island. That's all we're doing. You know what? Let's sail to that island. And, uh... I mean, I don't know, I don't know how long this trial is going to be. I probably have used most of it up by now. Ramshackle Sloop has a level of it. I can level my ship. Huh. That's kind of neat. Okay. Now this terrifies. Absolutely terrifies me, okay? I'm already nervous just sailing around the island, especially after seeing that shark. But we're going to brave the ocean. And there we go. Oh my god. Okay, okay, ah! Okay, I'm gonna adjust the sails a little bit. I'm gonna wanna get there as quickly as possible, so. Just a quick warning though, if I fall in the water, I'm done. Without the, without the cartooniness of Sea of Thieves, this is, uh, this is way too realistic. I can't handle this. And I'm soloing it, and that doesn't help. Anybody know any shanties? You could really use a shanty right about now. <laughs> we say yo ho, but we don't say ho, because ho is disrespectful, yo. It's the only shanty I can pick up right now. What do you do with a drunken sailor seems too cliche. So we're gonna leave that. Oh. I can see why getting the increased visibility while sailing skill would be a good thing. Because that island that was back there, I can't even see that anymore. And a new island just showed up over there. Uh, yeah, that's. I'm not okay with that. Whoa! I'm not gonna look. But you guys can see the ship from underneath. 
Are we done? Are we done? Oh, oh god. We almost made it. If I get off the ship here, how am I going to get back on it? What happened? Your trial has expired. Okay, that was it. Guys, um, I don't recommend it. Just gonna go back to playing Sid Meier's Pirates. Thanks for watching. I can't believe I just did that for three hours. It was three hours. That little bit I got done was three hours. I can think of better ways to spend my evening. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys next time. Minion out. Okay guys, something I wanted to add in here real quick in closing. The one thing, I enjoyed Ark single player. The reason, the one thing I didn't enjoy about Ark and the reason I stopped playing and the reason I didn't do multiplayer is because when you log into an Ark multiplayer server, the islands are just overrun with, they're just saturated with player structures. You can't even build a campfire. You can't do anything. You can't build anything. You can't survive because you can't build anything because other players have already set up shop everywhere. Now, just in the first few minutes of Atlas on the multiplayer server, there were already f like five shipyards in that area. So imagine after this game is run for a while um, and you go into a multiplayer server, you're not going to be able to build a ship because there will be shipyards everywhere. That's, that's my prediction. If you enjoy survival games, you will like this game. If you're expecting a fix to the problems of Sea of Thieves, then you're going to be disappointed because this game is not Sea of Thieves. It is not like Sea of Thieves. It is not a replacement for Sea of Thieves. It is not the Sea of Thieves killer that some people are claiming it to be. It is a completely separate game. It is a survival game that also has ships and sailing. Period. That's my opinion. And what your opinion will be is up to you. Then you know.